total fluke, really. Um, we were, I had had a hockey practice in the morning and we were going from there to my younger brother Perry's hockey game at Cardinal Leger School in Saskatoon. Uh, we got there and there was no referee, uh, didn't show up or was not assigned or I'm not sure what the issue was, but uh, I had my skates in the station wagon, so I was nominated to vote and uh, referee their, I think it was novice at the time, but uh, referee their hockey game and uh, I made four bucks uh, as a 12 year old. I thought I was fantastically rich, so um, I, I kept going that year and then just slowly worked my way up. The game changed, uh, you know, drastically in my opinion that it got so much faster. Uh, there were no fourth liners that only played a minute and a half a night and you know fought every other game it's now it's to the point where everybody on the team's got to be able to play they all skate so much better than they have in the past they shoot the puck they're 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 just the teams are are built top to bottom now and, and you know the the skill level of all four lines on a team are, are significantly better than they were you know even 10 years ago I had played golf that morning here in Waska Sioux and uh, I came back to the cabin and my middle guy Josh, um, he wanted to go up and chip and putt. So we decided to go back to the golf course to chip and putt, standing on the other side of the putting green. I said to Josh, I said, you know who that is? And he, he had no idea, it was quite a ways away. And I said, well, that's Gordy Howe. So um, we went over and I introduced myself to Mr. Howe again. and. He, uh, he said that he remembered meeting me, but I'm not sure that he did, but he was very gracious. And, you know, he, he took Josh and put him in a headlock and, you know, told him to be tough in the corners and rubbed him around. And uh, it was just, it was, it was neat to see the interaction. And then after the fact, we got back to the cabin and my wife had told me that um, Josh had actually written uh, in one of his school projects that I think he was in grade one, uh, they had written that one of his goals was to meet Gordy Howe, and I didn't know that at the time. I remember when I got hired and guys were telling me that, you know, don't blink, it'll be over so quick, and I thought they were all crazy. Um, but, and it did go by fast. I was, it was hard to believe that, uh, that it, it went by that quickly. But, you know, all, all the, a lot of those games that you mentioned, like my first game in Pittsburgh when I um, was, was able to have my parents there and my wife, first playoff game. Um, all the milestones that a player would have, uh, I had those as well. Brad Meyer's path to becoming a renowned NHL referee is a testament to his dedication and passion for the game. Born in Ohio, his early years were influenced watching his father Ron play for the Dayton Gems of the International Hockey League. When he was nine years old, the Meyer family returned to his parents' home province of Saskatchewan, settling in Saskatoon. Embracing his hockey roots, Meyer would excel as a player to reach the Junior B level and pursue degrees at the University of Saskatchewan concurrently. He embarked on his officiating journey at age 12, almost by accident, when he filled in at one of his younger brother Perry's games with no referee. Meyer continued to climb the officiating ladder, making a mark in various leagues throughout Saskatchewan while working for the Saskatoon Fire Department. In 1987, Meyer achieved a promotion when he entered the Western Hockey League, where he officiated for 12 seasons. Recognition of his on-ice prowess resulted in professional opportunities across leagues like the West Coast Hockey League, International Hockey League, and American Hockey League. He attained the highest level of officiating certification from Hockey Canada and was assigned to international competitions such as the 1995 World Juniors, 1996 World Championships and 1998 Nagano Olympics. A life-changing opportunity came about in 1998 when the NHL extended an officiating contract his way. Seizing the opportunity, Meyer retired as a firefighter to focus entirely on this new endeavor. After two seasons split between AHL and NHL games, Meyer earned full-time NHL referee status in 2000, a position he held until his retirement in 2022. Over his illustrious NHL career, Meyer officiated 1,459 regular season and 97 playoff games. Other career highlights include working the 2014 Sochi Olympics, the 2017 Stanley Cup Final, the 2017 Centennial Classic, as well as the 2011 and 2019 Heritage Classics on the Prairies. Despite the demanding nature of his role, Meyer always made time for family, wife Colleen, 
Children Jackson, Josh, and Sophia, which was well spent in Prince Albert National Park. His connection to Northern Saskatchewan includes cherishing moments like introducing his son Josh to SHHOF inductee Gordy Howe during Mr. Hockey's last visit to Waskasu Golf Course in 2012. Meyer's journey stands as an inspiring chapter in the Saskatchewan Hockey Hall of Fame's official category, celebrating a remarkable career that spans borders and oceans.